Welcome to Los Scandalous Shake and Bake Arena, home of the Los Scandalous Volts and Dam. Wait, what? Both teams share the same arena? Uh, yeah, except when they're playing each other, and then I don't know who the home team is, really. Oh, uh, now I'm confused, Grim. The teams are juiced up and ready for blood as they take the field for NFL action. The Carolina Panthers battle the Los Scandalous Volts. Welcome to MFL Game Day. Grim Blitzrow here. Let's listen in on the sidelines and hear what the team's captains have to say. Hey, man, this game's on schedule now. You know what have. Are you ready for some MFL action? Am I? I love MILFs. Newtons, I'd like to fuck. He said MFL, not M-I-L-F, you halfwit. Oh, I thought you were talking about the Mayhem Bowl halftime MILF lingerie girls team. What a zombie QB with that big rack of ribs and almost no waist at all. Oh, oh, va, 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 boom. Well, one yard is better than nothing, but not by much. And it's first and ten. And the back gets in there and swats the ball away. He can't catch, but he sure can swat. Second down and ten. Oh, man, I love this dirty trick. Uh, come on, man, you got to catch that. I don't catch anything, man. I'm retired. Third down and ten. Oh, great tackle! When his brain is unscrambled, he'll be thinking about that hit. Yeah, most likely in a convalescent home. First down and five. And the defense goes for the jugular and rushes. It's not how many times you fall, it's how you get back up. Yeah, in this particular case, I'm thinking defibrillators and 100 cc's of adrenaline. I do do it. <laughs> First and two. Seven. Hey man, nobody can touch you when I ball. I take all you mutants out. That's right. Hey. Right. 
Boring, but smart. Time to punt. Whoa, whoa, you can't say that on the radio. And he got it off. That's a decent punt. Nice catch. And he turns on the app. Pow! And how about a little dirt sandwich? And it's first and ten. Wrestling? And that'll be second and eight to go. Oh, and the quarterback threads the needle for a first down. First and ten. Caught for the first down. And it's first and ten. And that's a sack. The quarterback has to get rid of the ball there. Second down in a very lot. Talk about Butterfingers, he should have had that one. Well, good luck. And he's able to grab that one somehow and hold on for the first down. This guy has a nice set of hands, Grim. It's the third set of hands he's had so long today. Looks like it's a good fit. five yards third down and long Chunks of yards with pinpoint passing. And this field goal is certainly within the kicker's range. The kick is good. comes the kickoff. Let's see if the defense can hold them. He sets up for the return. Let's see if he can break one wide open. And it's first and ten. Offense says it's time to put the ref out of his misery. Through the 
defense on that play and picks up a nice chunk of yardage. Second down and more than the QB would like. shot extra point but you never know with kickers <laughs> straight through the uprights when you get knocked down you got to get right back up and fight yeah, what about when you get knocked up what do you do then run So well on that play, he should go to lost wages and deal cards. First down. And it's first and ten. Oh, what a brutal hit. Second down and five. First and ten. When the receiver runs away from the pass marker, that's a good clue that something's not right. Second down and ten. Gets his bell run for a yard. Third down and nine. Kickers practice for this kind of kick every day. Pretty standard. Nothing standard when you got bloodthirsty mutants on the defensive line. It goes right through. Yeah, like a double stop burrito from top. And there is nothing in the rule book for that penalty. The ref appears to be cheating. He's just making shit up. Jumps off sides to kill the ref. They say, we're mad as hell and not going to take it anymore. <laughs> well, here comes the punting unit. You know, punters really do know how to party, Bricks. Yeah. 
Oh, yeah, I have pictures that, uh, well, maybe actually shouldn't discuss this on the air. No return on this punt. The defense will just down it. I can't tell if he's smart or scared. Either way, the ball is down. And it's first and ten. Hot, hot one, hot two, hot two. Nice run for five yards. Second down and five. Hot, hot one, hot two. Just starting to pick up some speed. Hey, Grim, I know a guy if that's what you're after. And that'll bring up third and one. And this guy is supercharged with electricity. Man, he just laid the wood on him on that one and knocked the ball out. Oh, and he breaks free and has nothing but open field in front of him. Some who would argue that we should just skip this step and make touchdowns worth seven. What, and kick the kicker's job in half? they just be called sinners. It's good. Here comes the kicker. Oh, I can't wait to hear this. What's the kicker, Grim? Uh, this guy in the field. Oh, I thought you were going to tell me a story like, here's the kicker. When I turned out the line, it wasn't wrong in my bed. It was a if there were any functioning brain cells before that hit, they're gone now. He's going to have the IQ of a rutabaga after that hit. And it's first and ten. Hot, hot one, hot. Right, oh no, it's a sticky ball dirty trick. And that's a sack. Speaking of sacks, has anybody seen my powder? I'm itching like crazy over here. Second down in a lot. Hot, hot one, hot two, hot, hot, hot. And the running game is starting to click now. A pickup of eight on the play. And that'll bring up third down and seven. Hot one. Two. He picks up a two. You know, sometimes the best thing to do is just punt and let your defense get the ball back. And he put all of his foot into that one. First and ten. And the defense gives up five yards there. Second down and five. Either the defense is trying to keep some time on the clock for their offense, or someone let a real bonehead touch the controller. Third down and six. He could go all the way! They're gaining on him! Hey, come on, move your ass! I got a saw up right on this asshole! calls a timeout. This is why you save your timeouts. You can use them in the two-minute warning. Now I get it. Makes sense, Grim. And it's first and ten. First down! I see this guy drop a 
a lot of balls in the past, but I heard the quarterback threaten to throw him. The quarterback is controlling the clock like the clock is into it. I know I am. The offense wants to speed things up, so it signals a hurry up. Yeah, same as Britz's ex-girlfriend signaled when they were doing it. Yeah, she called it rabbit sex. I took it as a... And into the end zone for a touchdown. Once he got his hands on that pass, he was off to the races. Well, this should be an easy chip shot extra point, but you never know with kickers. <laughs> it goes right through. Yeah, like a double stuff burrito from Taco Hell. Let's see if they can keep the momentum going and keep these fans happy and uh, or bloodthirsty, whichever. Love the sound of bones snapping and cracking. I mean, when they're not yawn. Time to speed things up. The offense goes into a two-minute drill. Hot tag. Second down, and they use their second timeout, but they are running out of time. A bit pessimistic, don't you think so, Grim? It's more about building tension, Bricks. That's all we do at this point, and drink this bourbon. Come on, give me that. <laughs> Nicely done for a first down. And that's the end of the second quarter. Someone will need to pull together some bribe money as they head to their lockers. Stay with us for the Halftime Show, brought to you by our friends at Monsatan Industries. We make genetically altered Frankenfood you'll have fun trying to identify. The teams line up for the kickoff to start the second half. These guys will have to play a lot harder to make it a game. Well, either that or kill and cheat more. The home team is feeling confident as they get the kickoff into the air. Scoring makes anyone confident. It certainly does, Bricks. It certainly does. High five! Second down in a very lot. Like he just ran into the line at the DMV. And guess what, Grim? That line ain't moving. Yeah, that was kind of my point, Bricks. Third down, and the punter is warming up. And then a first down from a great catch. Was it a catch, though? Let's consult at least 72 pages of rules to figure it out. And it's first and ten. And he picks up maybe four on that play. Second down and six. First and ten. He caught it, and nothing was going to stop him from getting into the end zone. Except maybe self-doubt, but he seems to have worked through it. Hey, Bricks, they're going. 
one for two here. And it puddles forward for the two-point conversion. The home crowd isn't impressed with that showing, but their team has a chance to respond. Second and eight. of the quarterback's tight spirals and magnetic personality. If this guy could talk before he died, what do you think he'd be saying, Briggs? Psycho killer! Just to say, what the fuck, 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 fuck! First down and six. Defensive player got blown to bits. You want to do some fun on your turn? Second down and six. warming up. for one when you could go for two. It's always been my philosophy, but Bricks can't even get one. And he runs it in for an easy two points. The momentum in this game may be shifting. Oh, those are just my balls. Hey, thanks for sharing, Bricks. The best kind of kick is when it's right after a score. Hey, speak for yourself. I'm usually the one who gets kicked after scoring. First and ten. Hot, hot one. In a fight between King Kong and Godzilla, the player on Roid Rage would win. Oh, sure, now he catches it. I had this guy on my fantasy team last week. I lost so much money on him, not to mention my kneecaps. My loan shark is very anal about collecting my money on time, Graham. First and ten. And that's a run for no gain. Then it's not really a run, is it? Second down and ten. 
Catch. And that'll bring up third and one. The kicker should make this, but you know how it goes in this league. When you give up points, you need to get them back. Here comes the kickoff. Let's see if they can make them pay. And it's first and ten. First and ten. And then a first down from a great catch. Was it a catch, though? Let's consult at least 72 pages of rules to figure it out. run there for eight yards <laughs> the third quarter has ended and we'll need a huge rally or a high death toll to make this one interesting second down and two And that's just a great run for a touchdown. Now this reminds me of a lap dance I had by a skeleton once. Oh yeah, after the mayhem ball and club 16 under. Yeah, yeah. My wife could smell the bun there on me when I got home. Big trouble. Okay, nice and easy like a two-foot putt. You miss two-foot putts all the time, Grim. Straight through the uprights. Here comes the kicker. Oh, I can't wait to hear this. What's the kicker, Grim? Uh, this guy in the field. Oh, I thought you were going to tell me a story like, here's the kicker. When I turned out the light, it wasn't a broad in my bed. It was a chick wearing a wig. goes into their two-minute drill. Which coincidentally happens to be Brent's match stupsing time. That's why the girls call me Speedy Gun. And that is called for a first down. <laughs> and it's first and ten. <laughs> oh, a great catch, and he picks up a new set of downs. <laughs> and it's first and ten. down give this guy a few catches and watch his confidence take off he is deadly in the open field bricks one. oh he just got crushed and it's first and ten. Oh, big catch big run big touchdown and yeah, big deal mr meat for brain friend with a ball and didn't fall out Don't try to get fancy here. Just put the ball down and...
and kick it. In that order, Grim? The kick is good. As expected, those are pretty much just gimmies. They need a good return here to set up the offense. And that's a returnable ball. Returnable? You mean he can get a refund for it? No, no, Bricks. It means he can return it for... You know what? Never mind. And it's first and ten. A second there. Second down and ten. And an eight yard gain on that one. Like when Bricks' mom decided to move back in with us. Third and two. First and ten. And the quarterback drills one in for the first down. And it's first and ten. And he rumbles it. Let me tell you, getting shot is no joke. I used to wear triple wool socks, slide around on a shit top. Mistakes here. Just kick the ball through the upright, for God's sake. It goes right through. Yeah, like a double stuff burrito from Taco Hell. Here comes the kickoff. Let's see if the defense can hold them. Looks like he'll be able to run this one back if he's not terrified for his life. He is, but he's got no choice. First and ten. Man, he's running like a bull on steroids. That'll be a first down. In a hurry-up offense, there is no huddle, so neither team can put their players on the bench. And Lil Katz will give them a first down. I don't know if they're his, but he sure has a good set of hands. I don't even get out of it. And it's first and ten. Caught for the first down. Where's out the defense since they can't rest their players? And this guy looks like Thor on a revenge bender right now. Quarterback passes for a touchdown. And here comes the extra point attempt. Straight through the uprights. The home crowd isn't impressed with that showing, but their team has a chance to respond. First 
first and ten. Oh, that was a big hit. Hey, Bricks, I'll bet you took a lot of shots like that over your career. Ah, uh, let's see. About a quarter after three, Grim, but my watch is a bit slow. It's the two-minute warning. You know what that means, right, Bricks? Yeah, take a giant whiz and get in a fight in the men's room. Second down and seven. And that was a bone crusher right there, folks. The defense calls a timeout to stop the clock. They have two left. And that'll bring up third and one. Republican congressman hits the airport men's room. Good and hard. First down. And with one timeout remaining, the defense has to get something going here. And it's first and ten. First down. He was not going to drop that one. They need to make him a target more often. And no more timeouts. The D needs to stop. This is intense. No, Grim. Camping is intense. Did you get it? Idiot. And it's first and ten. Boat all grim? Nope. Well, I have on several occasions. Not surprising. Multiple times on each occasion. Not surprising. And trust me, that hit was worse. He's not going down, and he reels that one in for a first down to keep the drive alive. First down and three. are lined up for the kickoff. They're going to be able to return this one. The quarterback goes into a hurry-up offense. He's looking for a quick score. Aren't we all, Grim? Aren't we all? Looks like a pass, and it's bouncing right back to the QB. The sticky ball that, my friends, was an all pro NFL hit. Second down and more than the QB would like. And that's perfect coverage. Nice deflection. And the Los Gamos both take the win today. After a stomping like that, the opposition may be a permanent part of the field. More like a graveyard, Grim. There are body parts everywhere. And speaking of body parts, did I ever tell well, let's you... Let's listen to the MVP. I'm sure he has something inspiring to say. Once again, the folks at Evil SN thank our viewing audience and the Mutant Football League for allowing us to telecast this sports presentation. This is Grim Blitzrow with Brickhead Mulligan and Bricks Jr. signing off. Today's game was brought to you by Comcrack Entertainment. They're not happy until you're not.